Another question I get asked quite frequently, in fact the most common question, are carnivorous plants easy to look after? And for the most part the answer is yeah. And people say, oh, but you would say that. You've had them for years. You know, you know how, how to uh, keep them alive and stuff. But the thing is, I, I am very lazy by nature. I, uh, I, I take the easy route out. I was, I was, can't be asked is one of my favourite phrases of all time, quite frankly. And if these plants required an awful lot of effort to keep them, up, up, uh, to keep them alive and required perfect, perfect uh, settings, I wouldn't be bothered with them, frankly. Uh, but they don't. Uh, Venus flytraps, picture plants, and, and sundews particularly, as long as you get a decent amount of sunlight on them each day, as long as they're kept in like one or two centimetres of uh, rainwater, and it must be rainwater by the way, tap water usually has chemicals which can uh, which can, can kill them off or really weaken the plant. Uh, so yes, yeah, so sunlight, the rainwater, if you have them indoors, you can feed them every few weeks or whatever. Sometimes you'll catch their own stuff. If you have them outside, they'll they'll be all right. I'll do their own thing. Um, I'm less fond of keeping the tropical picture plants, the nepenthes as they're called. Uh, I've had a few of them, but the one thing I've had in common is they've all died off eventually. And the reason being is because I keep them outside in my greenhouse and the overnight low temperatures that they're they're meant to get get uh, withstand are lows of. Uh, eight to ten degrees centigrade and obviously we only get higher temperatures than that in England at the middle of summer and given the fact that they died off every year or so with such regularity uh, and they're very expensive as well I simply didn't bother with them but uh, Venus flytraps, sundews and the normal pitcher plants they're uh, also known as trumpet pitcher plants or uh, North American pitcher plants I find to be uh, very easy to grow.